everyone, my name is Christy Horan. I am a fitness trainer in Washington, D.C. My mission is to inspire women through daily movement to feel confident, to feel strong, to feel empowered, to make a greater impact in the world. Today, I will take you through a 15-minute total body burn workout. All you need are a set of weights, and a mini band. So dumbbells, I'm using five pound weights today and a medium mini band. It's 15 minutes. Total body burn is a mix of strength training movements and cardio. So you get the best of both worlds. I recommend having water, towel, and wearing sneakers. So if you haven't had those already, go ahead and pause me, come on back and we'll get started. All right, now that you're ready, let's go. <laughs> So I'm turning up the music. We're starting off with a warm up. So back into your place. Again, like I said, you need weights and a mini band. Roll your shoulders back, big inhale all the way up and all the way down. Yes. Reach up to the ceiling right here. Reach it all the way up, arch back and then down. Reach, arch back and lower. We got two more like that. And then we bring it into lower body movement. And you got four, three, two, one. Lunge it right and left. Open up through your chest. Lean back into your heels. Yeah, just like that. We got eight more here. So good. Here's six. You add a twist, so opposite hand to opposite foot. You got three, two, one. So twist it to the right and left. You can slow it down to really feel the stretch here. Engage through your abs, pull your shoulders down your back, lengthen through your spine. One more inhale all the way up. You got three, two, one. Let's inhale all the way up to the ceiling. And then exhale all the way out. Big hamstring stretch. Relax through the back of your neck. Maybe shake your head no. Maybe nod it yes. <laughs> Bend your knees and then roll it up vertebrae, vertebrae, vertebrae. Shake it out. Walk to one edge of your mat. Walk it out into a plank. Warming up through your core, exhale. So touch the outside of your foot, come back to center. Outside of your foot, back to center. Again, abs in nice and tight. Squeeze through your glutes. Whew, you are almost done with your warm up. We're bringing it to cardio for the last 30 seconds. Mountain climbers in three, two, one. Mountain climbers, drive your knees into your chest. Pick up your chin. Press the back of your head up to the ceiling. Come onto your toes for high knees. In three, two, one. Jump it up, high knees. Woo, move your feet. Good, lift through your chest. All right, you got 10 seconds left. We end with drop squats. So take it down, lift it up. Down and up. Woo. Breathe through, sit your hips back. You got five, four, three, two, one. Let it go, shake it out. Water towel, whatever you need. Like I said, we're moving quick. I'm gonna angle this down a little bit more so that you can see my feet. <laughs> okay, so first things first, we start with our mini band. You put your mini band around your calves. So put it right around your calves. Come on down to the mat. Lay on your back, feet on the mat, hips up, lower, reverse crunch, lower your legs down, bend, and then down. So that's a sequence. Up, down, hips, lower, bend, plant your feet. This is all timed. I'm keeping an eye on the timer. You just work. Whew. Okay, so one thing I want you to focus on when you're lowering your legs down is keeping your spine flat, peeling your belly button away from your shirt and towards your back. Lift it up. Keep pressing into that mini band to the outside of your thighs. Get work too. All right, you got 15 seconds left here. Bend, press it down, squeeze back to your glutes, lift it up, so close. We got five seconds. Let's do one more. Lift, lower, up, lower down, bend. I want you to grab the backs of your thighs, rock and roll on up to a sitting position. So right here, you've got a squat, right leg goes down. Just keep working with me. Down, push, down, push. Yep, really big squat. Lift it up, squeeze through your abs. Whew. You got less than 10 seconds. Then you move on to the left side. Three, two, one. Squat down, 
left leg. Squat, make sure your toes are parallel. You're putting your weight in your heels here. I'll turn to the side so you can see me. Back and then lift. One thing that I notice when I'm teaching those live classes, sometimes my client will like to go over like a penguin. Try to stack your shoulder and your heel. You got 10 seconds left. Whew. You're taking that mini band off of your thighs in three, two, one. Okay, take it off. Keep it around your right foot. Lunge, high row. So you want your elbow to come wide. Shoulders, hips are totally square. Relax through your right hand. Smooth through the back side of your neck. Whew. Yep, and then your weight is in your right heel and your left toes. You got four, three, two, one. Okay, let's switch it. So now the band goes onto your left foot. It's the same exact thing. So you're hinging forward and then high row. Make sure to relax your shoulders. You don't wanna pull your shoulders up and cave in. Abs turned on, back lengthened, and you're not sinking into your back leg. You're pulling up. We're going into triceps after this on your knee. Whew, breathe through, you got five, four, three, two, one. Take it off, come on down to your knee. Left knee back, right hand grabs onto that mini band. Wrap it around like you're about to do a stretch. Go right into triceps. Extend through your wrist. Glue your elbow into your temple. Pull your shoulders down, engage through your abs. Yep, that's it, that's it, keep it moving. Whew. So you'll actually feel this on the outside of your chest as well, in addition to the back side of your arm. Keep strong through your wrist. Get ready to switch in three, two, one. You're switching arms and legs. So left leg comes front, left arm behind. You grab that band, pull it up. So you should feel that resistance. It's nice and sticky as you press your hands up to the ceiling or the sky or wherever you are today. Whoo! Breathe through, hinge forward a little bit so that you're not exposing your chest. So seamless from the top of your head to your tailbone. You got three, two, one. Guess what, this is where the cardio comes in. We're going with one jack, touch, jack, squat jack. Lift, lower, lift, lower. After this, you get a quick drink of water, you move on to the second circuit. Oh yeah, you're doing amazing. Lift and lower, woo! Okay, I want you to look at me as you come down into your squat. So try not to drop your head, keep it lifted, make eye contact with me, beautiful. Whew. Breathe through, you're almost there. You got 15 seconds, that's what I mean by almost there. So close, here's 10, woo! Beautiful, five, four, three, two, Last one, finish it. Yeah, shake it out. <laughs> Next, we focus on hamstrings a lot. So we just did outer legs, thighs, low abs, triceps, and back. For this next circuit, you'll need your dumbbells or your hand weights, whatever you have. Like I said, I'm using five pound weights today. Okay, just move it through with me. You start down on your mat, you only need one weight. We start out with a sit up into a wood chop. Woo, sit up, wood chop to the right. Come back to center, roll back. Make sure your shoulder blades stay off the mat. Twist, lift, down. Lift it up, twist, lift. On your twist, try not to rock on your hips or let your knees come up. You want to glue your heels and your knees to the mat. Okay, halfway through, I want you to add a move. So as you come down, lift your legs up, bend, extend, lift. So a little challenge for you. All the way down, legs lift up, suitcase crunch, use your low abs to pull you up. Whew. Lower down, relax the backside of your neck, come on up. It's almost fun, right? <laughs> you have five seconds. We'll even it out by finishing out with a left wood chop and your suitcase crunch. All the way down, 
bend, extend. Okay, relax. Grab your second weight. Come back onto your back feet nice and wide. We've got a chest press. Lift through your hips. Chest fly. Lift through your hips. Rotate. Chest press. Chest. Woo, we did this full total body burn workout yesterday in class. And my chest is killing me. I think it was the combo of push-ups and these chest press and chest flies. Down. As you lift your hips up, I want you to squeeze through the backside of your legs. Push your heels into the mat. Feel your hamstrings or the backside of your leg light up. You should also feel the bottom side of your glute turn on as well. Okay, you got 10 seconds. Woo. Down and lift. You're coming up for more hamstrings in three, two, one. Okay, I'm gonna rock and roll it up. I'm holding on to my weights, but if you need to drop them off and then come up, totally fine. Drop off one of them. Let's do left leg down, right leg up, right hand holds. Okay, hold on, bear with me. Left leg down, right leg up, left hand holds onto the weight. So you hinge forward in a single leg deadlift, you curl it up in a bicep curl. Single leg deadlift, curl up in a bicep curl. What helps me is to squeeze my low abs, so engage your belly button to your spine, Keep your elbow glued to your hip as you come up. Think about squeezing through your uh, thighs and take your feet and toes nice and wide. All right, you're almost done with this side. Whew, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Engage through your core. Oh yeah, we have less than 10 seconds. You got three, two, one. Other side, so now you right legs down, right arms down, lower, lift, left leg is up. Extend through the back side of your leg nice and straight. If this is way too much or you're losing your balance, deadlift, curl, deadlift, curl. You have 15 seconds left. Again, push through your heel, smooth out from the back of your head to your tailbone. Whew. Oh yeah, I can feel my leg wiggling a little bit. That's totally normal. Just squeeze to engage it. You got three, you got two, you got one. Let's do some bicep curls. So grab your other weight, take it up. Bicep curls to the front for 15 seconds. Then we'll go out to the side for 15. So you have about 90 seconds left in this workout. I know, it went by so fast. 90 seconds left. 30 more seconds of arms, then you go into a cardio blast. Take it out to the side. Lift and lower. Good, abs and tight. You wanna put that soft bend in your knees. Then pull your shoulder blades together. Yep, expose your collarbones like you're wearing such a beautiful necklace right now. You wanna show it off. Whoo, 15 seconds. Beautiful. Let's get it. We're going into skaters after this, skaters. If you don't know what that is, just follow along. You got five, four, you ditch the weights in three, two, one. Ditch those weights, you move side to side. So we're gonna go 30 seconds, skaters. 30 seconds, final finish of cardio. Breathe through. Yep, if it doesn't feel good to touch, you can bring your chest up or tap your toe behind. I wanna challenge you by reaching to the edge of that mat. You can do it, you got this. You got less than 10 seconds. Whew. Then we're going into burpees. I know, three, two, one, let's get it. All the way up, all the way down. Whew. Option to take out the push-up. Keep your chin lifted. Push through the back side of your legs by pressing your heels into the mat. You got 10 seconds left. You got this, you got this. Push through, push through. Here's five, four, three, two, one. Walk it out. You did it! Water towel, whatever you need. Shake it out, big inhale in. Exhale, release. Whew. Roll it up. One more like that, inhale. Exhale. Bend your knees. Roll it up. Right arm comes across. Pull your shoulder down. Tilt your head to the left. 
Let it go. Left arm comes across, heads the ray. Shake it out. Beautiful job today. Let's end with an inhale and exhale. Big inhale all the way up. Exhale to heart center. Drop your head. Give yourselves a big round of applause. Yay! <laughs> awesome job. If you loved this, please go to my website, www.misschristygirl.com. Sign up for live classes. We have live classes every day but Sunday. Would love to see you there. So would Prince. <laughs>